Perfect. Come meet me in that pawn shop down in Mission, next to BDS Mania. This sounds like a weird one. Is it a weird one? <laughs> it's a surprise. Hey, uh, one of our newbie followers reports something strange. On the key. What? Vamos pegar esse aqui antes de ir pra lá. Prime 8, Lenny? Why's she calling us? It was a prank call, right? <laughs> I shit you not. She wants our help. Of course, she didn't say it that way. It was more like, Hey, douche nozzles, you want to play with the cool kids? Meet me or get fucked by a porcupine on meth. I'm not sure what to do with that. I guess I better check it out. Better you than me, my friend. Gee, thanks. Ah, get this guy oh, no, away! Man. I'm with the Não, 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 não vi. Ah, já era. Search there. Mano, eu tô pegando três, tá pegando só. Caralho. Tá mexida. Ah, obrigado. Muito obrigado por você aqui. Negócio de 
de upar. Do negócio de arma. Eu quero equipar mais de uma. Esse aqui é bom também. Vou dobrar a câmera. Como é que eu subo? Vai, que merda, velho, que merda. Online access is a simple click away.
mexer lá, não né? tem jeito. Quase. Oxe, de novo. Quebrou. Quebrou a ponte, maluco. Como é que eu faço agora? Falei no susto. <risos> foi, 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 foi. Agora podemos ir.
Fiz bonita ali e foi cair. your horses I'm looking through my kitty feeds now man ladies and gentlemen pervert cold fucking menace let's wreck his world last time I got a never-ending supply okay so when can we meet because I need something new for the weekend well, prices are going up Chris this is exclusive material I'm providing one customer one... ah what the fuck are you doing Chris I didn't do anything well can you hear me yeah, I think that was on your end, man. Must be a bad connection. Where'd you go? I'm right here. No, not you, Grizz. Do you have the footage or not? Yeah, yeah, I know everything's cool. Um, uh, on second thought, I got another kid in mind for you. <laughs> Lost my fucking train of thought. You were talking about bankrupting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is primo. Oh, hold on, Grizz. Honey, put on your pajamas and brush your teeth, please. What is it? Oh, something's coming that you're really gonna like, Grizz. I'm gonna need two grand. Fuck! Go! Oh, my footage! You mean my footage? Is it gone? No, Grizz. You'll get your vids. I just gotta call you back. What the fuck did I ever do to deserve this shit? Thousands of dollars down the drain. It's not one thing, it's another. Swear to God, I'm cursed. Who, who's doing that? Sick fuck flies on somebody. Get the fuck out of my house. Get the fuck. I gotta fucking find you. I'm gonna fucking find you. Did you get all that? Yep. Jesus Christ. I wish I could reach through the camera and strangle that guy. Don't worry. This footage is already circulating. Society will do the strangling soon enough. Bikers. Consider it a follow-up on home CEO. Yo, check it. I was on the treadmill when this pissy-looking guy came up with a trainer and kicked me off. Dickhead looked familiar, so I asked around the gym. It was Steven Bates. <laughs> Hey Marcus, you should try Roxanne in Tang War. That's that's Elvish. Hey Sitara, hey, put this up on the screen, Josh. It's from Miranda. You're being followed. A friend of mine has given this to you at great risk. Watch your backs. There's a target on it. Target? What? That's us. Fuck. Right now. And check this one out. Someone's spying on us from right outside. Hey, hey, hey. Shit up. Hey, be cool, man. Sneak out. I'm gonna go out the front and see if I can uh, spot our tail. Yeah.
What would you guys think about shooting a little exercise fail video starring the CEO of Holmes? Steven Bader? I'd love to have another go at humiliating that pompous ass. Why an exercise video? Peeping Steve is at the gym right now. Buckle in and get ready for a show, my friend. <laughs> Christmas is coming early this year. Marcus, check out these texts I pulled from a cop. There's a van. Yeah, that's them. Get what you can on. obsessed with these things as a kid. Damn, that takes me back. Think you still got it? I'd love it if Dead Set could one-up the cops on this. Our followers would eat it up. You just give me that cryptogram, son, and I'll see what I can do. Falo isso. Meu carro. There's a van. Yeah, that's them. Get what you can on. Thank you. 
so. Yeah. Sure, sure. Yeah, uh, yeah, sure. I... No, I, I, I... Yeah. Restricted area. Jesus Christ! Passar aquilo ali no stealth vai ser difícil. There's a van. Yeah, that's them. Get what you can on.
so bad at all. Ai, santa paciência, cara. There's a van. Yeah, that's them. Get what you can on. Right now, wrench. Ah, totally. Ah não, 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 no final. No final. Marcus, we're good. Get the fuck out of there. Mas a como, filho da mãe? Pula, pula.
told her boss. Pardon? Wrench? What is it? We're messing with the FBI, man! We gotta totally restrict communication on this. Okay, but... Minimal communication, M. Face to face is best. Meet me at the place where... You know where. Wrench? Wrench! Damn! To the cafe, then. Uh... Marcus, one of our latest followers sent me this. Consider it a follow-up on home CEO. Yo, check it. I was on the treadmill when this pissy-looking guy came up with the train and kicked me ratio. off. He's not answering Dick and his phone doesn't... Through. Mark his phone on your map. Sure. <sighs> what would you guys think about shooting a little exercise fail video starring the CEO of Home? Steven Bader? I'd love to have another go at humiliating that pompous ass. Why an exercise video? Peeping Steve is at the gym right now. Buckle in and get ready for a show, my friend. <laughs> Christmas is coming early this year.
I'm about to need some. this
Oh, okay. You don't. No. I mean, some of my Yeah. Oh, no. Where you at, Slowpoke? Right here, waiting for your ass, Slowpoke. Uh, at least I didn't climb up the wrong building. Oh. <laughs> Fucking shit! <sighs> Thanks for the hand. Got in with a group of street artists a while back. Showed me how to see the city in a new way. Move through it in a new way. Didn't last long, though. They were more concerned with selling t-shirts than making statements. <sighs> Think you can handle it? Yeah, sure. Uh, piece of cake. But, uh... Good job, you know. Mm. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I'll send you some hot spots to get you started. Make me proud.
Okay, let me plan. Yo! Ranch! Where you at, man? Yo! You're late! Mark you mark! As much as I enjoy our banter and <clears throat> underlying sexual tension. I'm hurt. I thought we moved on to overt sexual tension. Marcus, there's something I want to show you. On my laptop, dude. Oh, where you? Did you? <laughs> Pull up chair. And prepare yourself. For the breathtaking, spine tingling, and almost entirely mind numbing noodle keynote. <laughs> Cue it up. You all told us, hey, self driving cars sound pretty. But we have always prided ourselves in delivering the best. What do you think of a car that knows you, knows who you are? The kind this, of security that awesome, only very biometrics yeah. can give you. Your key is you. Then in the morning, you want time to read the news and drink your coffee while it safely drives you to work. It will remember your preferences and save them right into your biometric profile. For those who opt into the CTOS insurance programs, you get good driver discount automatically and access to fast transit lanes. Sounds too good to be true? It's not. Because at Noodle, we don't wait for the future. We build it. Huh. So they want to add biometric data on top of those CTOS monitoring systems? Yep. Because that couldn't possibly go wrong, right? I mean, we all know how altruistic CTOS is, right? Oh, and insurance companies. And how they would never, ever use our biometric data for their own nefarious purposes, right? Yeah, milk of human kindness and all that shit. There is something wrong in the state of Denmark. Maybe, uh, some daring vigilantes should check it out. Maybe, perhaps steal a cool car while we're at it? Because, you know, auto theft's always fun. Yeah. Yo, Marcus. Satara, what you got for me? Well, it's a good thing you like driving. Looks like the lead engineer on the biometric car project is a loyal customer of Driver SF. Is that right? Sure is. And I just may have set up a script to reroute his ride requests to you first. Slick. Only the best for DeadSec. Check the Driver SF app on your phone when you're ready. <laughs> Ooh, that one's on me. All right. Yes. Yes. I know. Yes, right. I see. So I'm gonna need to convince him to take us to his office, right? Yes, but we've already got a plan. That we do. <laughs> Ray, you in on this one? Well, it's like Ranch says, car theft is 
always fun. The plan is that we hack this guy's phone. Right. Set off the alerts on his phone, saying his computer at work is getting hacked. Which makes him freak out and race into work. But we won't actually hack his computer because we don't really need to. Exactly. We just need him to think it's been hacked. I like it. Well, all you gotta do is distract him so we can hack into his phone. Best care possible because a healthy community makes a happy community. Bay Area Medical Foundation is a West Wind Health subsidiary. So, uh, where am I taking you, man? Hot date tonight? My girlfriend just broke up with me. How am I gonna get this guy talking? What was that? I couldn't hear you. Sorry, just a little nervous, that's all. This is the first ride I've done in a while. Yeah, had a bad experience, you know, and took a break. Yeah. I can imagine you'd see all sorts of shit driving people around. What happened? Oh, hell yeah. All sorts of shit. Last one was a bunch of drunk guys. Mm-hmm. All yelling and hollering at each other about some, some sort of art car they were working on. Oh, for that uh, desert festival? Yeah. So the two of them are yelling about LEDs and animatronics and sand and yeah, what kind of drugs people should be on to view their art car. Seriously? They talked about what drugs people would be on? To tailor the experience for the right kind of hallucinations or something? Yeah, exactly that. And then one guy... Look out! Yeah, exactly that. And then one guy, he punches the other guy right in the mouth. What? So there's blood going everywhere. Meanwhile, the guy who threw the punch is whimpering that he broke his knuckles. Shit. I know, right? So I end up driving them to the nearest emergency room and get this. Yeah? They both try to hug me when I drop them off. Wow. Oh, uh, sorry. My alarm just went off. Have to check this. Shit! Shit, shit, shit! We gotta change direction, buddy. I'm sorry, but I need to get to work. No problem. Updated the destination in the app. I got it. No worries. We'll get you there. Shit! Somebody's breached security. Fuck! The one time I'm not in the office. Uh, yeah, that's that's how it always happens. Can't believe this is happening now. We have deadlines, massive deadlines. Yeah, man, that sucks. I hate this project. Why did I ever say I'd be lead? Uh, can you go any faster? I'll try. Shit. Speed up? I'm trying. I'm in a real hurry. I'm okay with you speeding faster, please. Almost there. You're a lifesaver, man. I am totally giving you a five-star review on the app. No problem. It's my job, after all. You're the best. And here we are at Coda Print. Okay then.
know it sounds sappy. They just kept chasing me. I ran three blocks, and when I thought I lost them, I looked back. here. Hey, sorry, huh? Huh? Clear out! Find someplace safe! Let's get everybody alert! And get... Finding cover! Here we go. Time to get to work. I had faith in you, Marcus. It's not like the rest of us did. Yeah, I have lots of faith in Marcus. I have faith in Marcus. Wow, guys, you all just made my day. It just means so much to me to hear you say that. Yeah, yeah, I wasn't trying to imply anything. I'm surrounded by clowns. But you love us. Well. Maybe Josh and Marcus. Ouch! That's okay. Right, it's a bit early in our relationship. It's wrong. I have an alert. Okay. 
time to get to work. I had faith in you, Marcus. It's not like the rest of us didn't. Yeah, I have lots of faith in Marcus. I have faith in Marcus. Wow, guys, you all just made my day. It just means so much to me to hear you say that. Uh, yeah, yeah, I wasn't trying to imply anything. I'm surrounded by clowns. But you love us. Well, maybe Josh and Marcus. Ouch! That's okay. It's a bit early in our relationship to be throwing words like love around. Take your time. I appreciate a man who has patience. Oh, well, well, this very patient man has work to do. Look over there, I got it out! No! Hey, what's that? Control, be advised that a possible target or targets have been reported near your location. Kind. No way are you coming in. Hey, I know this guy. Found it, guys. Great. This should contain all the security specs and info we need. Soon. We will be proud joyriders in the noodle car.
off this project. Lucky fucker. Retiring so young. The man is always breathing down my neck. Seriously, but needs to get laid or something. Jim was saying he's starting some nature photography business. Crazy to leave Noodle for something like that? But I guess being in the ground floor at Noodle means you can do whatever you want and never have to work again. Damn stock options. Josh found something interesting in the car's algorithms. Yes. There's a decision-making algorithm. They call it a life score. They fucking call it a life score? A what? It's a method for deciding which lives to prioritize in case of an accident. Yeah? Yeah. You're gonna log this one. The car's onboard computer has direct access to Bloom's databases. It pulls up a score according to metrics Bloom sets. Employment, income, education, race, gender. Fuck! Let me guess, me and Ray get into an accident, one of us on either side? I'm SOL because I'm a young black dude. No, not quite. As you know, I'm persona non grata with blue. My life score is pretty damn low, so in that case, I'm SOL. But otherwise, yeah, you got the chest. Voice print and a retinal scan from that noodle VP who Me gave the key note to unlock the car. Right, I'll get on. Sending you a Zach? Just found the guilty hardware. Demorar quanto tempo, hein? Pra vir cá? Pra vir cá? Of course. 
Whoops. Ah, nice. Place. Time to find out who's been fucking with us. And make him pay for it. Right, this is Prime 8. Fuckers. Looks like the phones were just a test run. They're gonna hijack local radio with a list of our names. Well, they were gonna do it. Oh, tell me how you're gonna hurt them. I erased the DedSec names from their system. It was a pretty extensive list. Some of it was guesswork, but they had some solid matches. I went through the guy's account and grabbed a bunch of Prime hey, 8 names. You're gonna make sure that radio you know hijack me. works. More algorithms, you? more problems. Yeah, but I'm changing the playlist. I got the location, but I'll need to find a way to break in like they did.
If I'm healthy for the whole year, they told me I get three months free. Makes sense to do. Okay, there's our CEO. I hope he enjoys the workout we're about to give him. Knock him off his cankles. <laughs> Dude, are you okay? Uh, oh. You get all that? Marcus, that was the most beautiful thing I've experienced today. Sending the video out. The sheer beauty of a douchebag falling on a treadmill could bring peace to the world. <laughs> Since when do you want peace? I mean metaphorical peace.
like this place, huh? Food is average. Uh, get anywhere? I can't tell if she thinks my mask is hot or creepy. The main FBI office is in the Delamus building. We really need the rest of that data. Because? Because something hinky's going on, man. Something big. Different hackers I know, they've been noticing vans falling around and shit. Uh, well, it wouldn't be the first time the FBI's tried to strong arm hackers. Join us or die type shit. Why now? The timing is suspicious given our popularity. How much do you trust Ray? You might have cut a deal. Oh man, no way. Hey, trust me on this one. Okay. Maybe Miranda can help? Yeah, maybe. She uses a car service all the time. I'll tap into the feed and show up as a driver. Can I, uh, can I get you anything? Uh, I'm just leaving. But can I ask you a question? Mm-hmm. Do you think my friend's mask is hot or creepy? Both. You staying for another cup of coffee? Have a good one. Huh? Bye, man. Gonna hurt Marcus. Oh, I'm what are you doing? That I... Hey Miranda, just making a few extra bucks taking fares. As if. Where are you going? Going to visit my mother. You followed my lead? Yep, FBI. I cannot confirm or deny that. We want to strike back, but I couldn't get all the data. I need to get into their Oakland office. You're coloring way outside the lines, Marcus. Yeah, and? Is that why you showed up as my driver? You think I'm being scoped by the feds, too? Isn't that why you wouldn't tell us where those photos came from? I was merely being prudent. And I'm being prudent by talking to you in person. So, Marcus... I'd be remiss if I didn't point out that a young man who discovers that the Federal Bureau of Investigation is after him should probably re-examine some of his life choices. Good advice. Particularly a young black man. Guilty. Good. What was I saying? Oh, good. we got gotten that out of the way. So how did you get those photos of us in the bar? Let's just say I have a source. Does your source have anything else I should know? Word is the feds are going after hackers hard. They're trying to co-opt or blackmail every group they can. For what? They want control of all the zero days, and they don't want competition. Damn, now the FBI is in on it? Hacker might not be cool anymore. I'm not joking, Marcus. They're gonna come after DedSec, and they're serious. 
It's for the FBI office. I have a friend that can help. Don't have to use the Moscow rules. What's that mean? It means there's an old-style payphone outside of Dellums. Pick it up, identify yourself as Fred. Record the signal you get. Yo, that's fucking dope. <laughs> I'm gonna give you a shit rating on the driver app. <laughs>